Spiritual formation isn't a Christian thing, it's a human thing. Every minute of every day, we are being formed by a complex interplay of forces. We're formed by our habits, our relationships, the stories we believe, and our environment. All this happens over time and through experience. The first four forces are more active, more about what we do. The last two are more passive, more about what is done to us. But most of our formation is unintentional. It just happens. We wake up, go about our normal life, years go by, and one day we realize we've been formed into a particular shape. Which means for those of us who desire to be formed to be like Jesus, we don't start with a blank slate. We've already been deformed, not into the beauty of Jesus, but into the ugliness of sin and shame. Therefore, at some level, all formation in the way of Jesus is counterformation. To be formed to be like Jesus will require an intentional, thoughtful, conscious way of life to counteract the many forces that malform our soul. To counter our habits, we need the practices of Jesus that turn the fulcrum of our heart in a new direction and open our inner world to the presence and power of the Spirit of God to change. To counter our relationships, we need community, where we travel the way side by side with other apprentices of Jesus, and we are loved into people of love. To counter the stories we believe, we need the teaching of Jesus to fill our minds with truth. And to counter our environment, we need to live aware of and in connection to the Holy Spirit, who is the animating center of our life and the ultimate source of all transformation. These counter practices form our souls slowly over time, and especially through times of suffering where we are not only formed, but forged into the love and peace and joy of Jesus. This is intentional spiritual formation, a life architecture of discipleship to Jesus that is deliberately designed to be more robust than the cultural forces all around us and the internal forces of our own heart. The key idea is this, we are going to be formed. Jesus' desire is to form us to be like Him. But this will require us to organize our days around intentionally following Jesus and finding deep joy in our everyday lives with Him.